Jungkook. Jungkook, wake up. No Hyung, it's Saturday. Yeah, and other parts of the house are freezing cold because you left your door wide open. What are you talking about? Look around you. Yoongi Hyung? Jin Hyung? Why is everyone? Jungkook immediately sits up. My room. The rest of the house is also covered with ice frost. And you are the only culprit. Why me? Because Namjoon Hyung already questioned us. Plus your room is the only one that's covered a lot in ice frost. Yeah, only your walls are completely covered with that and it's also like two times colder in here. Wait a minute. Seok Jin pulls the blanket off Jungkook. He's dressed in his winter clothes. Who goes to sleep in those during the summer? Guilty. Okay, I woke up during the night and I was sweating so I turned up my AC to the limit, but it started getting way too cold so I woke up and changed into this. Everyone looks at Jungkook in silence. Oh. I am the culprit. Oh my god. I figured it was you after seeing your AC is completely frozen. What? No. How are we going to turn it down if it's frozen solid? There's only one way. Move out? Ha ha ha. Nope. Namjoon opens Jungkook's windows. Whoa. It's so warm outside. I'm gonna melt. Whoops. I meant for the ice to melt. Well now that we found a solution I'm gonna go finish recharge. Wake me if you guys need anything. We'll do Hyung. You go get your beauty sleep. Yoongi leaves. We better be prepared to clean up the water after the ice melts. Of course, I better go open my bedroom windows. Me too. I'll go see if Yoongi Hyung opened his. They leave the door open after walking out. I'm gonna make myself some breakfast after I open my windows. Oh. You want me to make you breakfast to Jungkook? Sorry, I don't make breakfast for fake friends. You do you Jimin Hyung. Jungkook jumps out of bed. This isn't the response I was expecting. Anyway, this house may be cold but it would never change my warm heart that's full of love for everyone. Yeah, you're just trying to clear your conscience. Jim Jungkook. Namjoon Hyung. Jim Hyung. That's right. Why is my door opened? I can hear everyone talking and yelling. I can see you Yoongi Hyung. Oh hi Hoseok Hyung. Oh hi Jimin. It's so cool that everyone's door is opened. It feels like the neighbors. Good morning neighbors good morning. Jin Hyung. It's too early to have guests over. Go away. I just came to borrow a pair of mittens. Move aside or I move you myself. You can't tell your neighbor such an absurd thing. How dare you step foot on his base and command a pair of mittens? Can someone close my door please? I really need to recharge. Sorry Yoongi Hyung. But all the doors need to be opened for the ice in the hallway to melt as well. But how am I supposed to get sleep when everyone is talking to each other from their rooms? Please keep your voices down everyone. One of our neighbors is trying to recharge. Jungkook whispers. Can I borrow your mittens? Yeah sure. I'm going to see what Jimin is making. For breakfast. Oh look. I can see Yoongi Hyung closing his eyes. I will not disturb. Young happily goes down to the kitchen. Are we expecting someone? Not that I know of. Hello, package for Kim. Um, who is the package for? Did you forget why you came here? Huh? No. Sorry about that. Here's the package for Kim Nam Joon. Am I tripping or does his living room look like the inside of a freezer? Is that why he's wearing winter clothes during the summer? If I were to take the chicken out of the freezer right now it wouldn't make sense cause our entire house is also ice cold. Um, thank you for delivering the package. Oh, you're welcome. Bye. Bye. Who was it? A delivery man. I guess Namjoon Hyung ordered something. My package arrived. Namjoon takes the box. What's inside? The book that I ordered. I heard it's so good and I'm so excited to start reading. But. Why is one book in this huge box? Maybe they had no smaller boxes left. I'm taking your word for it. I'll be upstairs. Namjoon leaves. 
After I have this toast I'm going straight back to bed. I wasn't ready to wake up. Are you planning on sleeping in? Yeah. Some time later. Yoongi, wake up. Come on. You gotta get up before the, the flood gets worse. Huh. Flood. The ice is starting to melt and... There's gonna be a bit of a flood soon, so we decided to hit the beach. Hey I tried to wake Jimin but he said 10 more minutes. He will be walking through water if he doesn't wake up now, tell him he can sleep when we get in the car. Okay. Jungkook walks in the room while scratching his hair. Good, you're awake, the only person left is Jimin. How long has it been since I went back to sleep? From 5.30 to about 8, which is now, obviously. What? I woke up at 5.30 on a Saturday? Everybody say thank you Jungkook. Everybody say no. Thank you Jungkook. Yoon Gi Hyung. He's on my side. The only side I'm on is my bad side, as you can tell. Love that one Yoongi, you learned a lot from me. Yeah, sure. What are you three doing just lazing around? We have to be in the car in 5 minutes. I can't believe what I'm seeing. Is that disrespect I'm hearing? Relax, okay Hyung. Jungkook walks to Taehyung. Are you up for a match since you seem to be in the mood? I was just acting. Too late. Jin Hyung. Jungkook runs after Taehyung out the room. Now he calls me. These kids. Yoongi leaves the room along with Seok Jin. In the garage. Okay, now that we're all out here we can finally discuss the plan. After we finish have our fun at beach we can drive around and do other things for a few more hours. That way it'd give the ice enough time to melt completely. And when we get back, we put on our rain boots and start cleaning up the water. Simple. Any questions? Why can't we just wait at home for the ice to melt? Good question. It doesn't make sense staying here and cleaning up water every time when the ice melts. It's better we wait until everything fully melts off so we can clean up in one go. Oh yeah that makes sense. Hey, did anyone pick up the beach chairs? I already put them in the trunk. Wait, shouldn't Jungkook be cleaning up since he's the cause of all this? Not when I'm the youngest. I never raised you like that. Alright, you two can finish bicker in the car, let's get going. Many hours later, the boys get back home. Everyone puts their rain boots on and Yoongi opens the door before they all start walking in. I can't believe this, the ice barely even melted. Wait what? But it's summer, it was super hot out today. The windows, they were closed the entire time. Ah shoot, we probably forgot to open the ones downstairs. Well at least we know we had opened our bedroom windows since this morning. While rubbing their arms for warmth they walk upstairs and see that the ice there had barely melted as well. No we did not. They immediately look in their rooms. We really closed our windows before we left the house this morning. I can't believe this. How could I not remember that the whole point was to leave the windows open so the ice can melt? No, I can't even look at myself right now. Really all I can say right now is that at least we had fun while we were gone. Yeah, had fun being clowns. What was past me thinking? It's way too cold to sleep in here tonight, and it won't be very comfortable sleeping in a beanie and scarf. And layers of clothing. We'll stay at a hotel for tonight, everyone change into your winter clothes and start packing. What a relief that we don't have to sleep in this refrigerator. Like summer, yeah, I'm making you sweat like that. Bring it down! Oh, when I look in the mirror, I'll make you honey do. I got the superstar. <laughs>